One two pitch. In the air up the line and right. Gibbons can't find it. I'm not sure Chuck Merriweather could either. It landed fair. The scale to the plate. Over the third is Matt Lawton on the opposite field. Snow affected. Base hit off the bat of Ellis Burks. Jake Gibbons never had an opportunity to pick up the baseballs. He was asking for help right from the beginning. And what I was talking about earlier in the ball game, Jay Gibbons lost the ball in the snow. He could not see the ball going to right field. And now Mike Hargrove is going to talk to home plate umpire Tim Welke. Mike says that this game should not continue, and that's what's going to happen. They're going to take the players off the field during this snow. As you see, the flurries coming down, and we should point out to the fan, the Yankees will make every effort to play this game because the snow is supposed to get heavier later on, and the chances of playing tomorrow would be less than they are today. Back with the pitch and gets strikeout number one. So he comes back with a harder pitch. The cutter down and in. Because that ball just feels like, like you're holding a, a crystal ball or glass in your hand. Fastball and he gets Bob Hamlin. That is strikeout number three in a row. In these kind of conditions because this weather favors the pitchers. That time he did get him. Pick off number two. Put another opposing runner in the P.O. category. Big breaking pitch from Andy Pettit. Strikeout number four. To the runner on third. Jeter has the chance at short. His throw a little low, but Martinez is there. Hamlin goes right side. That's it. Nicely done by Andy Pettit in terms of commitment. Has anyone ever broached the idea as Pettit gets his fifth strikeout, McFarland down? Towards short on a couple of hops. And the toss to Duncan in time. So Jeter handles that. Oh, another breaking pitch, and McFarland is set down by Andy Pettit. What a job of pitching. Andy Pettit, one of baseball's great bargains at 150,000 a year, leaves the field after a terrific opening day performance, and he's hearing it from the brave fans here at Yankee Stadium. Allowed just one run on six hits, and he has struck out six.